feeling a bit dead. I'm feeling like I'm gonna squat out. I'm feeling like, yeah, I'm feeling it. Feeling the vibe here, so hey guys, it's me. <laughs> oh, I'm just living life. Taking it rated R, but rated R to the point where you can pass the law with it. Okay, let's do this. Oh, yeah. This is truth or dare, but apparently they want to call it would you rather. I said truth or dare, actually. So let's begin. I feel like the first question is really like messy. So it says, would you rather, ha, would you rather only speak in questions or only speak in movie quotes? So, um, I'm not much of a reader quote, quote reader, literature, nope, no, that's not you. So I would say only speak in questions. Hair butt crack is showing. That's how it sounds. That'd be cool. Like that, would, you wouldn't offend anybody. Like you wouldn't be. It wouldn't be rude, right? So the next question is: Would you rather snort one crushed up Aldoid? Aldoid. <laughs> okay. Ah. Uh, let's call. Let's phone a friend. Yo. Hello. Mm hmm. I feel like I would do. Or take a shot of one ounce Tabasco sauce. I feel like I'm a Tabasco kind of chick, but I want to snort. I want to snort. I want to see what that nostril life is about. So I'm going to say snort one crushed Altoid. Oh, snap. 36%. Okay, that's embarrassing. <laughs> okay. Would you rather? This one's really, this one, give me a little bit emotional. Sorry. Would you rather, oh, okay, would you rather win the World Series, obviously not, <laughs> or win the Super Bowl? Um, when I came to this country, I thought the Super Bowl was a hangout spot where all the teens, the Raiders, saw dude, surfers, everybody went and they like bowled around like, you know, like skated. So I'm going to say World Series because that sounds more intense. So World Series, 41%. 41%. So I'm not really that popular and I'm okay with that. Like it. Cool. Digging it. Uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> this one's very harsh. Would you rather hang out with Pooh Bear? Only on the weekends. Only me on my day. What would you call it? Or hang out with Pablo from the Jungle, Pablo from the Jungle Book. I mean, Pooh Bear is kind of like harsh with the honey. And I think he kind of ODs with honey a little bit. Like he needs to calm down, take a, a couple cups down. So 55%. Okay, we're getting there. Yeah, yeah. It's really intense. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Would you rather have to end every sentence with rather? <sighs> I'm going to Google that. I don't know what that means. Okay. Would you rather have to end every sentence with a racial epithet? I don't know what that word sounds like. I don't know what it means. Or have to drop two F-bombs in every sentence. I'm going to say racial epithet because I don't know what that means. And I feel like F-bombs are really, you have to really know how to slide them in. And I don't know how to do that. So, whoa, 25%. Okay, probably if I did somebody. Okay. Mm. Would you rather? Yes. What? Ooh. Oh, yeah, that was me. It's not, I'm in the bathroom. <laughs> would you rather lick peanut butter off a hobo's foot? I, why would I even question that? Done. Lick it. Lick it real good. Was those $250 in the stock market? No. I'd rather just... Because... <laughs> $250 could potentially like build up, you know, like that could build up over time. Think, think with think, 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 think with this and this, maybe a little bit of this, I don't really know, cool. So like a peanut butter off a hobo's foot, especially if I get to know the hobo, if I get personal with him. You know, we've been chatting for a while. I'll lick peanut butter off his foot. Like, a, like, like, a, like that, like, like a little bit. 23%. I don't blame them. You know, it's risky, but I still do it, so. 
Would you rather get high or get crunk? Get crunk. I would probably get high because liquids don't do well with my body. I would probably get drunk off oxygen. Oh, no, no, no. I could get drunk off. That sounds like that sounds futuristic because everybody does that right now. So, next one. Would you rather talk only to an auto tuned voice? Yes! Yes! Yes, I would. Talk only in auto tuned voice. Yeah. Oh. That wasn't even it. I just. Oh. Hey guys, what's good? Yeah. Yeah. Talk only. 78% obviously. Okay, next question. Would you rather have anything you write become truth? Wow, that's really deep. Wow. Know all the truths there are to know. Well, if you can write your own truth, that'd be pretty darn cool. Like, you have that much power. That means you can write, like, you can unwrite truth. Like, you can unwrite somebody else's truth. That's still really risky. But I would say that. Have anything you write become true. Because how much things could you wish for? You could be like, I have a million dollars. Okay. Or, uh, I have an embezzlement that went successful. I'm not. Mm. Would you rather slam your hand? in every door or fall down every flight of stairs i'm already familiar with the falling and i think i'm my body's grown numb to falling down a particular set of stairs so i'm gonna say falling down the stairs and i am not that popular with that one 49 percent nope would you ever Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> would you ever <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. Would you rather spit on an angry Mike Tyson? Is that the one with the guy with the bit off the ear? Would you ever spit on Mike Tyson? Okay, angry Mike Tyson. That's different. I don't I don't really think it's different, but you know. Or spit on an angry Bruce Lee. Mike Tyson, I can lose an ear, but like internal bleeding, that'd probably be not me. So I can handle like I'm biting my ear off. Bruce Lee can really get in there. Like, he can really damage you from the inside out. So, I might not. I'm gonna do spit on an angry Mike Tyson. Oh, Rose right. <laughs> Don't mess with him. The Bruce Goose. Okay, would you rather be stabbed in the stomach 10 times? Or be shot in the kneecap, stabbed in the stomach? There's bone in there. You know my nervous. You know how much nervous systems are in your in your bones. Why would you want to be stabbed in your stomach? Wait, what? No, I'm gonna pick stab in the stomach. Which one am I going for here? Yeah, stab in the stomach ten times. Wait, I'm like trying to like feel it. If somebody has an eight pack, they can be stabbed in their eight pack, like each, and then two for the back, cause your stomach's always way back, right? I don't. Yeah, so I would say stabbed in, stabbed in the stomach ten times. Uh huh. Sir, there's oh forty six percent. Sure, there's some internal bleeding. I talked about that before the last one, but you gotta give and take. Okay, next one. Would you rather be a homemaker? That doesn't sound cute. Didn't Martha Stewart go to jail? Yeah, she did. Yeah, she did. Okay. Would you rather be a homemaker or be a breadwinner? Breadwinner. That sounds cool. Sounds like you could get constipated with that, but still, I'm gonna be a breadwinner. Like, come through. 55%. A lot of people like to be in control. I know. <laughs> Would you rather be a robot or an alien? Mm, okay, that's not. I mean, <sighs> robots are artificially. I was gonna say inseminated, but no. Roto. Mm, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Robots? No, I wouldn't do it. <laughs> okay. Decide. Okay. Robots are artificially made. So, like, somebody could shut you down. Yeah, I'd rather be an alien. Like, what if I have a whole bunch of new technology, build my own robot army? You don't know. 
Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be an alien. Preferably from another galaxy, not on another planet. That's just too close. Okay, if you had to do one thing every morning, <laughs> would you rather do? Okay, no. Would you? Mm, mm. If you had to do one thing every morning, would you rather lay an egg? Yes. Or need to milk yourself? Okay. I feel like people, humans already milk themselves. It's natural. So I want to, you know, break away from that and lay. So lay an egg, 56%. Not that bad. Not that good. But, you know, bam. Because if you lay an egg, you got your own breakfast. No, that'd be cannibalism. Wait, when you lay an egg, is that your kid in there or just like yolk and okay, it's gonna get deep. It's gonna get deep and I don't wanna get there, so would you rather live in sorry <laughs> sorry. Would you rather live in live in oh would you rather live in a mansion in Beverly Hills, penthouse in Manhattan? I think we all know where this is going. A clay made house in Sri Lanka. But since they don't have that option, I'm going to go with penthouse Manhattan. Wow, it's really not popular. I don't know. I just kind of like being high up. And Beverly Hills, that's not where I want to be. Oh, Beverly Hills. Yeah. Yeah. Would you rather? <laughs> okay, would you rather? Would you rather stick your cut up in whoa? I felt a little sting there. This is gonna get this is gonna get MC17 real fast. Stick your cut up hand in a bowl of vinegar. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I do it. Would you rather be Tumblr famous or be famous on YouTube? I actually would rather be famous on Pixlr. Have you know you know what that is? Pickler? Pixlr? Or actually, you know what? Scrap Pixlr. Put Pixlr in a box and put it in recycling. I'd rather no, I'd rather be famous on MySpace. I'd rather be famous on MySpace. But since that's not an option, again, I can't type it in. I don't even know what that means. What game? 9%! Dang. Okay. Would you rather get one million? One million a year in quarters? Get one hundred thousand a year in bills. Okay. Here's what. Here's what. You hire somebody because you're getting a million. Hire somebody to sort that out. Make sure you trust them. Don't be shady. Um, make them sort it out. Have a really good bank. Pay them behind them back. And I would honestly take the one million and a quarters. I'm not that. I like quarters anyway. I like to polish them. They're shiny. Uh, very fluorescent. Not really. But I like them. So I'm going to go with one million and a quarters. I know you can still save a hundred thousand a year, but come on! Let me live my life. Seventy-nine percent. Wow. Okay. Cool. Would you rather have knee-length hair? Remember when you get shot in the kneecaps and you have knee-length hair? Sorry, I didn't just bring that back. Okay. Would you rather have knee-length hair or have one foot tall mohawk? <laughs> mohawk. That's the same as the knee-length hair. If you just like comb it down, it's the same thing. They're just not, they're not challenging me right now. They need to push me, they need to push me to the limit. I'm gonna walk. 45%? No. Mm -hmm. You can also donate here, so you can donate that up real quick. Would you rather be telekinetic? Ooh, I was gonna say telekinetic, but I, hold, I held it back. I had to think about it. Or be telepathic. Don't know the difference. But. Uh, I remember the movie. Remember the movie Carrie? Remember when she was like, ah! Remember that part? Telekinetic. 
It'd be cool to be in people's heads sometimes, but like not really, so. Would you rather, would you rather, sorry, I'm snorting. I'm snorting some asteroids, so the man. Would you rather be extremely paranoid? Uh, uh, who's that, who's that? Knocking on my window, hey, or be extremely naive. That's really bad. People can really get around your bushels if you're not, if you don't know what's up, if you don't know what's good. So I'm gonna say be extremely paranoid. That could get so annoying. <laughs> that could get really annoying. Okay. Feel in the comment section if you need anything, just double down.